Hi, and welcome to episode five of creating an epic prog metal song from scratch. If you want to see the series from the start, use the YouTube card here. If you've been keeping up with the series so far, then I really, really appreciate it. Do all the usual things that YouTubers ask you to do to support the channel and help it grow. This video was sponsored by the Northern Ireland Arts Council. When I was about 10 years old, I was really into art and drawing and painting and stuff like that. And my hero was Leonardo da Vinci. I read everything I could and saw all his art. One of the things that shocked me was to find out that a major criticism by Michelangelo was that he never finished anything. That struck me very hard when I was 10 years old and it has become part of my adult morality that if I start anything, I always make sure that I finish it. So today we're going to be finishing the composition phase of this prog metal song. On listening back to the song, we need to find some kind of end goal, some kind of conclusion to the song. So what I would like to do is create a crescendo. And the best way to create a crescendo is to bring all the dynamics down so that we can bring them back up again. I was thinking maybe the perfect fit for this would be acoustic guitar. Do you remember at the very start of the series, the initial idea for the song was C major into F minor. Well, I thought if we're going to go back to basics, let's go back to the original idea as well and try and develop it and reinvent it for the next section. So on acoustic guitar, and I'm tuned down to drop C, um, I found this way of playing the chords that I think is quite nice and it would move the song forward in a nice way. So I'll get that recorded and then we'll add some other instruments to it. From a lyrics point of view, I thought we're approaching the end of the song. So the first line that came into my head was in the end. Now I was kind of thinking that all the lyrics towards the earlier part of the song are dark and maybe pessimistic. And so in order to reach our crescendo, maybe we should flip and look at a slightly more optimistic outlook on the idea of regret. So I was working on the idea that in the end, we all die. So what's the point? Why not enjoy life when you're alive? So this idea of um, standing at the gate, we'll all see our fate. And I think maybe just acoustic guitar and these vocals alone for now to suggest a kind of a loneliness before the crescendo. In the end, all we'll see Sky. 
So at this line here, it's, I look you in the eye. When I sing I, I want to come in with a high note that allows the strings to sort of swell back into the song. Let's try that. And then on top of that, I want to add the slower strings swelling up. At the gates, I look you in the eye. I so let's hear that. And then the drums should come in there. I've made you sit through enough drum programming, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it off camera. Look you in the eye. I alone have conquered So we begin the gradual build up now towards the ultimate crescendo. I've got an idea where I'll reintroduce the staccato strings from earlier on and try and build it up from there. Can you hear it? Can you hear the crescendo is on its way? A time will come when only time survives and we will never see another sunrise. Outside of music, my other passion is physics, and so I really love it when there's some physics suggested in the lyrics of my music. Time will come when all it 
I'd like to listen to this whole section from the start now to get an idea where the crescendo is building towards, see what key we should be in and what ideas I have for it. But it's definitely on its way. In the end, all will see their fate Standing at the gates I look you in the eye Yeah, I'm going to think about that for a while and see what I come up with. I think this wee guitar part here should be over here somewhere. A time will come when all time... I think what the song wants at this stage is a rousing chorus in a major key. We're going to stick with the suggested key here of F major and use F major, B flat major, C major, one, four, five in the key of F. We're going to do lots of backing vocals, lots of strings, power chords on the guitar, leading up to a climactic guitar solo, which is going to take us back to the orchestration section that we introduced earlier on as a finale. Okay, so we'll probably want this section twice. And we'll add some strings here now. I'll put a 
on some high strings as well. So we have finally reached the optimism that I was hoping for. These lyrics take on board the story so far and set out a path towards the future that is optimistic and hopeful. Run for your life while you still got time. Plan your escape while the lights are still on you. Hold a course, set your sights beyond your reach for the story's just begun. And I really liked the idea of ending the lyrics by saying the story has just begun. I really like Luminous Choir from Project Sam. It's a free instrument and it sounds really great. Let's add it to the guitar solo. And I think the next thing is to go back through the song and find that orchestral section. Here we go. I think that'll slot very nicely onto the end of here. Yeah, we're nearly there.
Right, so we recorded quite a lot today and I think we're more or less finished with the composition of the song. The next step would be to get all the other musicians on board, the drummer, get him to do some real drums, record all the guitars as cleanly as possible, record all the vocals, maybe add extra backing vocals, do all the mixing, production, processing, all that stuff. So there's a lot of work in getting this song from where it is now to getting it to the finished product. But at least now that the demo is complete, we can hear what the potential of the song is and whether or not it's worth all that extra effort. So let's listen to what we've recorded today. Probably needed a guitar stab. In the end, all will see their fate Standing at the gates I look you in the eye And then I think we'd probably fade out. Okay, so that was great. Thanks for coming on this journey with me and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you found it useful and I hope it inspired you to make some prog metal of your own. You rock. <laughs>